getting my screen set up okay <laughs> hello everyone it's me it's mark and i'm here with you for another live stream class here before i do anything i need to know if you can see me and hear me if you can see me if you can hear me please say yes in the chat so i know everything is a okay if you can see me if you can hear me please say yes in the chat so I know everything is a-okay. Lolly says yes. All right, Lolly, thank you so much. Sleepwalker says yes. Thank you, Sleepwalker. <laughs> Tetsuro says yes. Thank you, Tetsuro. Mary says yes. Thank you, Mary. <laughs> Hello, Ella. Helga says yes. Thank you very much. <laughs> Samuel, hello. Nathan, <clears throat> or I should say, well, there's lots of names there. So I'm going to say Nancy. That's the easiest one there for me to pronounce, the easiest of the three names. Nancy. Hello, Nancy. Okay. Good, 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 good. All right. Let's see. Okay. Well, <laughs> I was just looking at the chat trying to um, get... I was reading and you guys are talking to each other. So anyways, I got a little confused, but that's okay. Well, um, thank you so much everyone for being here with me because without you, there's no reason for me to be here. So thank you for being here. Thank you for your time. Thank you for your kind support. I really, really appreciate it. Of course I do. <laughs> All right. Well, you know what we do. We always have a toast to start our class. So let's have a toast to start our class. Hello, John. Okay, so whatever you're drinking, please pick it up. I have here hot coffee. Woo, it's very hot, but it's, I'm sure it's delicious. I haven't had it yet. It just came out of the pot. I haven't had a chance to try it, but it's always good. All right, so we're gonna have two toasts. Ella, hello, Ella. Ella is here. Shaka is here <laughs> okay two toasts our first toast will be for the green team yes they joined the channel you see them their names are in green they support me they support the channel by supporting me and the channel they are supporting everyone so let's give the green team a big thank you cheers if you don't have a beverage we can fist bump bump cheers bump cheers and because we had a toast we have to have a drink so bottoms up Mm. Miley is in the house. Hello, Miley. G Bella is in the house. Hello, Bella. Okay, great. Hello, no gays. Oh, that's a that name I cannot pronounce. <laughs> okay, our second toast is for you. Yes, without you, there's no re reason for me to be here. So let's toast to you. Let's toast to a fun, interesting, informative, and productive lesson today cheers bump cheers bump and because we had a toast we have to have a drink bottoms up mm. it's very very hot so i could only take a sip right i could only sip it mm. oh feels good it feels good it's still a little chilly here in japan it's spring it, it's getting nicer and nicer every day it's nice outside but here in my office, it's still a little chilly. So the hot coffee tastes really good. It feels good. Yes, it does. Matsura is here. Hello, Matsura. Okay, let's talk about today's lesson plan. Maitra, hello, Maitra. We have one, two, three, four. We have five activities we're going to do today. Mano May is here. Hello, Mano May. We're going to do form a sentence. I will write a pattern on the board and you will write sentences based on the pattern. Then we will do a worksheet. Which one is different? It's a new one. And the topic is self-improvement, self-improvement. Which one is different? We're gonna do that. Then after which one is different, then we have another worksheet and that is 10 very short conversations right here. We're gonna watch a video and do the worksheet. This is new. 
Um, and then after 10 very short conversations, we got dictation cards. Then after the dictation cards, we have Lolly's Revenge. Last week, we didn't have time to do it, but we're gonna do it this week. All the worksheets and the cards are on my Patreon page. Go there, get the worksheets, get the cards, and support me. $5 a month, you get all the worksheets, you get the cards we do in the live stream class. Help me so I can help you. There's a link for it in the descriptions. Support me on Patreon and you get all the worksheets we do in the live stream class. So you can do the actual worksheets to, with me. We could do it together. Um, I will still, I'm gonna put the worksheets on the screen so you will be able to see them, but by supporting me on Patreon, you get the worksheets on your computer. Okay, good, good. Well, um, Sonia's here. Hello, Sonia. Okay, well, um, let's go ahead and get right into it. Let's do form a sentence. Okay, here we go. Number one, our first activity, form a sentence. Okay, form a sentence and here we go. It's a little, it's a little long today. Okay, it's a little long today, sorry about that. But it, it's a um, useful sentence and it's something we can talk about. Okay, here we go. I have been busy and then we want ing. This is the present perfect continuous. I have been busy, for example, um, working and I haven't had much time to go to the gym, right? Or So this is gonna be um, the <clears throat> base verb, I haven't had much time to uh, walk. I haven't had much time to play. I haven't had much time to um, go shopping, something like that. So we want um, ing verb and we want an, in, an infinite, just a base verb. Okay, so this is infinitive and this is our continuous, okay? ing verb and base verb. Okay, sleepwalkers on the board. Sleepwalker, I have been busy learning English and haven't had much time to learn other languages. Very good. Miley, I have been busy exercising and haven't had much time to cook. Perfect. <laughs> good job. I'm sure, Miley, that disappoints you. I'm sure you're very disappointed because you haven't had time to cook. And I know how much you enjoy cooking, so you must be disappointed. <laughs> okay, Mitra, I have had, okay, I have been exercising and haven't had much time to cook. Helga, I have been busy watching a detective movie and haven't had much time to prepare my homework. Nice, everyone's great sentences. Tetsu, I have been busy watching a movie and haven't had much time to go to the bathroom. Oh boy. Uh, Lolly, I have been busy cleaning the house all morning and haven't had much time to bake onion pie. Good sentences. Sleepwalker, I have been busy working and haven't had much time to meet with friends. All right, Niva, I have been busy studying, so I haven't had time to eat my lunch. Now I'm going to eat lunch. <laughs> Matsura, I have been busy studying and haven't had much time to go to the shop. 
John, I have been busy because I am doing my homework. Okay, good, good, good. Yep. Haven't had. Samuel, I have been busy chatting and haven't had much time to drink my tea. <laughs> Miley. Miley says, the others were happy. They make me do exercises on purpose so as not to let me cook. Don't let Miley in the kitchen. Keep Miley away from the kitchen. You should put a you should put a wall. So so the the door or the entrance to your kitchen, Miley, you should put a wall there. <laughs> put a wall on the entrance of your kitchen. Maitra, I have been cooking, but I haven't had much time to clean. I like it. Sonia, I have been busy watching Mark's live stream class mwah, and haven't had much time for lunch. For lunch. So two, we need, we need a verb. Okay, Sonia. So we can say, I haven't had much time to make lunch. Okay, so we need a verb here. To like to make, to go, to do, right? To do, to go. So we need just the, the base verb. So you can say to make lunch. I haven't had time to make lunch, but here we need a verb. Okay, Helga, I have been busy talking to my dove and haven't had much time to talk to my cat. Oh, I bet your cat is jealous of the bird. Uh-oh, maybe your bird will eat your cat. <laughs> or no, your, your cat will eat your bird. Oh no, keep, keep the cat away from the bird. Matza, I have been busy cooking and haven't had much time to make. We don't need the cake. <clears throat> to make a cake is better, Matsura. To make a cake. Tetsuro says, I have been busy talking with a friend and haven't had much time to eat spaghetti and pizza. Neva, I have been busy thinking about my interview and haven't had much time to get dressed. <laughs> Ume, or actually, get ready is better, Neva. Get ready. All right? Because to get ready for your interview, you have to do many things. Maybe, you know, like, like of course, get dressed, but also do your hair brush your teeth, wash your face, um, maybe, you know, clean the house, get ready before you go. Much. I have been busy studying physics and haven't had time to eat. John, I have been, I have been, okay, we want this pattern here. I have been busy because I'm doing my fan because of, oh, oh okay, so, okay. So your, your fan in your room, so you might want to say, I have been busy, well, I, I missed it there, John. I have been busy because, okay, I have been busy, um, what have you been busy doing? And I haven't had much time to fix my fan, fix my fan, but what have you been busy doing? So this ING, so, what have you been busy doing? Have you been busy doing your homework? Have you been busy um, have you been busy cleaning your room? Have you been busy uh, picking up your clothes? Have you been busy um, washing your windows in your room? Okay, Miley, I have been busy phoning and haven't had much time to clean the house. Mary, I have been busy working these days and haven't had much time to go out with my friends. Lolly, I have been busy painting my bedroom and haven't had, and haven't had time to do my chores. 
sleepwalker i have been busy walking while sleeping and haven't had much time to relax oh that's dangerous sleepwalker don't walk in your sleep you can hurt yourself Sonia, I have been busy watching Mark's live stream class and haven't had much time to watch other movies. Helga, my cat doesn't even want to smell the pigeon when I bring it to her. She's definitely, she definitely turns her head away. Wow, that's unusual. Well, that's good, right? You don't have to worry about the bird and the cat fighting. That's good. I know you're, you're, you're joking, Sleepwalker. John says, I have been busy because I need to go to buy a shirt because I need to go to a party on April 30th. Okay. Hello, William. Okay. Niva has a question. I don't understand. Have not had. Okay. So... You understand I have been busy and this is continuous, right? Something you're, you're doing um, from the past until now, right? So I have been busy working. So you started in the past and you're continuing till now, right? When you are speaking, right? So, so I have been busy. So from the past to the present and haven't had much time. So here we're using um, past tense of have. So to have time, but you haven't had the time. So it's in the past and haven't had, this is the, the, um, the past participle of to have, okay? So for example, have time. So have, so, so an expression, have time, have lunch, have a meal, okay? And so this, had is the past participle of have, to have, okay? And so it, it's in the past and you couldn't do it, right? Because you were busy doing this. So because you were busy doing this, you couldn't do this, okay? You couldn't do this because here you were busy. And you can't do two things at the same time, right? We can't do two things at the same time. So you couldn't do this because you were doing this. <laughs> do you, does that make sense to you? Does that make sense? Okay, Lolly says, I have been busy learning English and haven't had much time to feed Diamond. Oh no, Diamond must be hungry, Lolly. Oh no. Okay. I'm looking at the clock. We're busy today, everybody. We got, we got lots of things to do, and we're going to do more of this, okay? We will review this tomorrow. And I made a worksheet, and we're going to do that on Friday or Saturday, okay? So we're going we're gonna to have more practice with, with this, with the, um, past, or the, the present perfect continuous and the present perfect, okay? This is the present perfect. This is the present perfect continuous. So I made a worksheet. We're gonna do that on Friday or Saturday. Tomorrow, we're going to review this um, pattern, this, this um, sentence. And so we're gonna have more practice tomorrow. And then we're gonna do a worksheet based on this, okay? So this week, we're gonna do lots of um, practice with this pattern, okay? so. Let's go ahead and change activities. Our next activity is a worksheet. Which one is different? <clears throat> Number two. Which one is different? Okay, it's a worksheet. And how this works, we got we got two groups, group one, group two. <clears throat> In each group, there are four things. And then you have to decide which one of the four is different. And of course, why? That's your challenge. You have to express yourself in English. You have to say the reason why in English. That's your challenge. 
and I always give this example. We have four things, red, blue, bicycle, pink. Red, blue, bicycle, pink. Which one is different? Yes, bicycle is different because bicycle is transportation. Bicycle, a bicycle has two wheels. A bicycle is, a, a bicycle can go very fast. A bicycle can be important for some people. <laughs> a bicycle has two handles. A bicycle has brakes. Um, a bicycle has a seat. A bi we can sit on a bicycle. <laughs> so there are no wrong answers. The answers are endless. It's your imagination. So that is the purpose. Use your imagination. Express yourself in English. Matsura, I have been busy tidying up the house and haven't had much time to go to the supermarket. Okay, here we go. Which one is different? I'm going to put the worksheet on the screen so we can see it together. You can get your own on my Patreon. Go there, support me there, and get all the worksheets in our live stream classes. Here we go. Which one is different? There it is. And here we go. This is number 55. We've been doing a lot. This is, this is number 55, everybody. So, and the topic is self-improvement. Go like this. Okay, so we got group one keywords. Muscles, books, a school, patience. Here we go, one more time. Muscles, books, a school, patience. Which one is different and why? Group two keywords, an alarm clock, make money, a pen, an idea. Which one is different and why? Group two keywords, an alarm clock, make money, a pen, an idea. Which one is different and why? Okay, I'm going to make it perfect right there. Okay, that's good. There we go. Hey, Alice is here. Hello, Alice. Shams is here. Hello, Shams. Roberto. Hello, Roberto. How are you today? Okay, here we go. Lolly. Lolly's on the board. She says, muscles. Because they are part of our body. Mitra books, because you can read every time, anytime you want. Anytime. You can read anytime you want. Tetsuo, I think patience, because it's an uncountable noun. Sleepwalker, patience is different because for other things you need to have patience to get muscles. Finish school and read books. I like it, Sleepwalker. I like it. I like it. Great, everyone. Helga, I think patience is different because it's a feature. All right. I like it. I like it. Miley, muscles are different. School books and patience are practiced by wise people. Yes. Wow. You guys are like doing, you guys are on a streak. You did great um, form a sentence. Our first activity did great sentences. Now, uh, which one is different? This activity, activity number two, you're doing great. I like it. I like it. Umesh, muscles, because you can build them by exercising. Build them. Helga, I think a school is different because it is a building. Yes. William. Muscle makes my hand hurt. <laughs> uh, Tetsuo, I think make money because it means action. Matsuo, I think muscles are different because most of the go to jam. I don't know jam. What do you mean jam? Oh, John, I have been busy in 2020 because COVID-19, 
um, much more in Miramar, so I need to go to, oh, oh boy. Well, I hope you're doing good now, John. Sleepwalker books are different because it's plural. What about muscles? Okay, Bella, I think uh, muscles because it's part of our body to exercise in the gym. Helga, I think muscles are different because they are part of the human body. Umesh, books because we gain knowledge from them. Samuel, patience is different because it is a sense and exists in the mind. Muscles are different because it connects with our body, not brain. Or you could say, not our body. Wait, wait, it connects with our body, not our brain. So muscles are different because it, or they, right? Muscles, the plural, so you need they. Muscles are different because they connect. They connect with our body, not our brain. Okay, Umesh, a school because it's a building. William, books make my head unable to think and try. If there were no books, people would be stupid. Matsu, I think books because it's made from paper, or they are. So books, again, Matsu, you need plural. So I think books because they are made from paper. They are made from paper. Miley, books are different because you can live with the others. But you can't live without books, right, Miley? That's right, I think an idea because it's in our brains. Okay, good, sleepwalker. <clears throat> Helga, I think books are different because Good books are a treasure. Good. Yeah, the human body. Good. Umash, patience because you need willpower to have patience. Good. Ha, huh, William. Books can drive science mad. Okay, John. I think muscles are very strong. Good. Lolly, patience because it's an abstract noun right you can't touch patience you can't see patience it's it's a, a state of being so it is um abstract uh that's what i think patience because it's not material or it, yeah so it's not um it's not a material thing. Muscles, okay, are different because they connect with our body, not our brain. Good, good, Roberto. Good to hear. Shams, I think muscles because it's our body and experience. Helga, I think an idea is different because it can become material from I do. Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. I know. Okay. Um, an idea is different because it can um, turn. So an, an idea can become real. Okay. How about that? An, an idea can become real. So, so you have an idea and then you make it real, right? So I think an idea because it can become real. I like it. John, I think books... Oh, yeah, yeah, good, John. I think books are made from trees. Yeah, or you don't have to say think, right? You'd say um, books are different because they are made from trees. Good, good, John. So you say, I think books because they are made from trees. And so you can see so right here, John, you can, um, okay. So, so here, John, so right here, this is the pattern right here. 
I think, and then you choose one of these and you say, because, right? The reason. So you say, um, I think books because they are made from trees. Yeah, so here's your pattern right here. I think, and then you have books, right? So you put books right here. I think books because, and that's the reason. And you say, they are made from trees. Muscles are not made from trees. A school is not made from trees. Patience is not made from trees, but books are, right? Because paper is made from trees and books are made from paper. Good, John. I like it. So you can see, right? There's under the, under the words, right? Muscles, books, a school, patients. You see the pattern, I think, and you put the word in there because and then you say your reason so that's your sentence pattern yeah helga an idea can become real oh no william books can make people bored and boring william oh boy william books are your friend william <laughs> books are your friend Mary says, I think muscles because they are parts of our body and we use them every day. That's right. Without muscle, we would just be, we would just be like a jellyfish, right? <laughs> Without bones and muscles, we would be jellyfish. So we need bones. We need muscle so we can stand up and move. Ah, uh, William, you need to, <laughs> oh boy. Okay, uh, Miley, I think school is different because it contains the other three contents, books, patience with students, and lately with students, you also need muscles, yeah. That's right, you have to be strong. The teacher needs to be strong. Teacher should be, the teacher should have muscles. <laughs> Lolly says, a school because there are a lot of people in it. Roberto, I think muscles are different because they make part of physical features and the others do not. That's right, Mary. We're not jellyfish. We have bones. We have muscles. We are not jellyfish. <laughs> Don't be a jellyfish. <laughs> Go to the gym, exercise, don't be a jellyfish. Okay, good. I'm looking at I'm looking at the clock. Yeah, John, John says, I think we do not, if we do not have muscles, we will be dead. Yes, we will be jellyfish. Okay, good, 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 good. Let's, let's do our next activity. Again, we always, we always review. So tomorrow we will review the worksheet. Yeah, and so we'll have more practice tomorrow. Okay, Miley, take it easy, Miley. Okay, so let's um, go to exercise number three, step three. Topic three, we will, um, we will review this tomorrow, okay? Tomorrow, review it. You can get it on my Patreon. Support me on Patreon, get the worksheets. Okay, our next activity, 10 very short conversations. Number three, activity number three, 10 very short conversations. This is worksheet number 13, video and worksheet number 13. And here it is. We'll put it on the, first we're gonna watch a video, then we'll do the worksheet. <clears throat> okay, here is the, whoa, here is the worksheet right here. Again, 
Come on, everybody. Right there, you get all the worksheets. What a great opportunity for you. <laughs> okay, here we go. We are going to watch a video and then do the worksheet. So first we're going to practice with the video, then we're going to practice with the worksheet. So let me put the video on the screen. Um, the first part, we're going to say the sentences together three times. Then the second part, we're going to take turns. I will be A, then you will be B, right? So we will role play the conversation. So part one, we're going to practice saying the sentences together. Then part two, we will be the conversation. Okay, here we go. Okay, I think that's the video. Yeah, okay, that's the video. So let me make it full screen so we can see it. Okay, here we go. Okay, let's have a look. There it is, 13. We're doing 13 today. Okay, and let's roll the video. Here we go. We'll say the sentences together. Here we go. How did you get here? How did you get here? How did you get here? I drove my car. I drove my car. I drove my car. How did you get here? I drove my car. Hello, Carlos. What are these? What are these? What are these? Photos from my vacation. Photos from my vacation. Photos from my vacation. What are these? Photos from my vacation. I'm looking for the station. I'm looking for the station. <clears throat> I'm looking for the station. Julia, hello. It's over there. It's over there. It's over there. I'm looking for the station. It's over there. Let's play frisbee. Let's play frisbee. Let's play frisbee. Sounds fun. Sounds fun. Sounds fun. Let's play frisbee. Sounds fun. What should we do? What should we do? What should we do? Let's go see a movie. Let's go see a movie. Let's go see a movie. What should we do? Let's go see a movie. <clears throat> Thank you for coming. Thank you for coming. Thank you for coming. It's my pleasure. It's my pleasure. It's my pleasure. Thank you for coming. It's my pleasure. Can you use chopsticks? Can you use chopsticks? Can you use chopsticks? Yes, I can. Yes, I can. Yes, I can. Can you use chopsticks? Yes, I can.
Have you ever seen a volcano? Have you ever seen a volcano? Have you ever seen a <laughs> one more? Have you ever seen a volcano? No, I haven't. No, I haven't. No, I haven't. Have you ever seen a volcano? No, I haven't. How old are your children? How old are your children? How old are your children? Is that true, Lolly? Is that true? They are 14 and 16. They are 14 and 16. They are 14 and 16. How old are your children? They are 14 and 16. You are welcome. Whose birthday is it? Whose birthday is it? Whose birthday is it? Wow, Lolly, that's surprising. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Whose birthday is it? I don't know. Okay, here we go. Now we're going to do it. We're going to be the conversation. Role play. I will go first. I will be the purple sentences. And you will go second. You will be the blue sentences. How did you get here? What are these? I'm looking for the station. Let's play Frisbee. What should we do? Thank you for coming. Can you use chopsticks? Have you ever seen a volcano? How old are your children? Whose birthday is it? Okay, let's switch. You will go first. You will be the purple sentences and I will go second. I will be the blue sentences. I drove my car. Photos from my vacation. It's over there.
Sounds fun. Let's go see a movie. It's my pleasure. <laughs> Yes, I can. No, I haven't. They are 14 and 16. I don't know. Okay, good, good, good. All right, so that was the video. So now we will do the worksheet. So we'll put the video away, hide the video. Okay, good. Now we're going to do the worksheet. And how it's going to work is at the top is the conversation from the video. Then in the blue box, we have a pattern and then an example of the pattern. So let's have a look. Okay, there's the worksheet. Let's, <clears throat> let's bring it up so everyone can see. Okay, well, it's a little too big. I gotta bring it down a little bit smaller. Okay, so here we go. So we have the, the, the conversations. One, two, three, four, five, six. So we'll do the first six for now. And then in the blue box, we have a pattern. And then under the pattern, we have an example sentence. So conversation number one. How did you get here? I drove my car. Pattern. How did Example, how did you feel? Conversation two, what are these? Photos from my vacation. Pattern, what are? Example, what are you doing? Conversation three, I'm looking for the station. It's over there. Pattern, I'm looking for. Example, I'm looking for my keys. Number four, conversation four, let's play frisbee. Sounds fun. Pattern, let's. Example, let's see a movie. Conversation five, what should we do? Let's go see a movie. Pattern, what should. Example, what should we have for lunch? Conversation six, thank you for coming. It's my pleasure. Pattern, thank you for. Example, Thank you for your kindness. Okay, so we'll start with the first six. So I want you to uh, make sentences based on those patterns. Okay, Helga, how did you get in? I used my key, very good. Okay, Neva, how did you know that? Good. Matsura. How did you feel? I felt blue. So, so that's past tense, Masura. How did? Okay, so you need to say, I felt blue. Okay, Neva. What are those? Photos from my university. That's right, Mary. <laughs> you remember? So, we, we, we did a little chopstick. Um, lesson. You want to do it again? Sleepwalker, how did you get home? I took a taxi. Good. Cecilia, how do you know? From my mind. 
Yeah, there you go, Matsuha. Good. I felt blue. Nice. Good, Matsuha. Great. Okay, Maitra, how did you open the can? <laughs> um, with a can opener. With a... Oh, I did it. Sorry, sorry. I didn't see. So, um, the, 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 when you write your sentences, you know, spacing, because um, Maitra, you had no spacing, so I didn't see um, the I after the question mark. So, but put a, um, a space between the question mark and the next sentence. Okay, Neva, I'm looking for my children. Lolly, what are you doing here? I am listening to music. <clears throat> okay, we'll do that. We'll do a little chopstick lesson after we do these six. After we do the six, and then we'll we'll do the chopstick lesson. Okay, Cecile. Oh, John, how did you feel? I felt sleepy. So we need the the feel needs to be in the past tense. Felt. I felt sleepy. Cecilia, um, what are what what are there? No. What is there? What so what are those, right? You, you could say, what are those over there? What are, okay, Cecilia, what are those over there? They are my boxes. Okay, now let's practice English with Mark. Sounds good, Neva. Thank you. Mwah, kisses for you. <laughs> Umesh, how did you make it? By watching a TV show. By watching a TV show. Uh, how did you think? Um, yeah, how did you think Tetsuro? Okay, Matsuha, what are those? Um, they are keys. They are my shop keys. They are my shop keys. Okay, Julia, how did you know? Hold on, hold on. How did you know I, I was watching you? <laughs> I was watching you. Sleepwalker, what are you writing? I'm writing an essay. Helga, what are what are those? They are robbers. They are the robbers. Cecilia, I'm looking for my wallet. It's over there. Tetsuo, what are you eating? I'm eating spaghetti and pizza. You like spaghetti. So Tetsuo likes curry and rice and spaghetti and pizza. <laughs> Matza, I'm looking for my book. It's over there. Helga, I'm looking for the bus stop. It's on your right. Maitra, how did you take the photo? I took it with my mobile phone. Cecilia, let's find a book. Good idea. Umesh, what are the pigs for? They are to be eaten. Or you can say they're for the barbecue. Tetsuo, how did you, th how did you think? I think like, how do you think? I think like Steve Jobs. Alice, how did you have, no, how, well, hold on, hold on, Alice. How, how, how did you have your, okay, how did you have, how did you have your dinner? I felt so, okay, okay, Alice, how did you feel after your dinner? How did you feel after your dinner? I felt good. Lolly, I am looking for the museum. It's not far. Take the first right and it's on your left. Good. Sleepwalker, I'm looking for the nearest supermarket. It's at the end of the street. Matsa, let's play football. Sounds good. Oh, Tetsuro, I'm looking for my wallet. Oh, that's too bad. Samuel, how, how did you learn English? I learned by watching Mark. Thanks for teaching English. You're welcome. Thank you for this wonderful class. It's my pleasure. <laughs> Cecilia, what should we do? We should go to the cinema. What are you eating? Helga, 
what should you do? I'm going to have lunch, sleepwalker. Thank you for your care. Don't mention it. Neva, can you sing Japanese songs? <laughs> no. Matsura, can, thank you for coming. It's my pleasure. Lolly, what should you do in the morning? I, 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 I have to have a shower. Okay, okay, that's Lolly. What do you do in the morning? I have a shower. Um, what should we do this morning? What should we do this morning? What should we do this morning? Oh, let's um, let's go for a walk or um, let's go out for breakfast. Tetsuro, let's go see a movie. I couldn't agree more. Sleep Parker. Can you call me back later? Sure, no problem. Thank you for your lesson, Mark. You are welcome. Bella, how, how did you know that Peter was in Japan? Very good. Shams, how did you get here? I took a taxi. Sleepwalker, have you ever skydived? No, never. Mary, what are you doing here? I'm waiting for you. What should I study? English. Lolly, thanks for your patience with the green team and the other students. <laughs> My pleasure. Thank you for being here with me, Lolly. What are you having? Ice cream from the supermarket. Have you ever thought about me? Is, is it right? Yeah, have you ever, or you, it's probably better to say never, do you ever think about me? Do you ever think about me? Okay. Yeah, there you go, Lolly. What should we do this morning? Let's go out for breakfast. Mary, I'm looking for the nearest supermarket. It's over there. Okay, good, good, good. Okay, here are the seven, eight, nine, ten, seven. Conversation number seven. Can you use chopsticks? Yes, I can. Pattern, can you? Example, can you play golf? Conversation number eight. Have you ever seen a volcano? No, I haven't. Pattern, have you ever? Example, have you ever been to Japan? Conversation number nine. How old are your children? They are 14 and 16. Pattern, they are. Example, they are from Los Angeles. Conversation 10. Whose birthday is it? I don't know. Pattern, whose? Example, Whose jacket is this? Mary, let's go out for coffee. Roberto, I'm looking for the stadium. It's over there. Tetsuro, can you play the piano? No, I can't. So Tetsuro, the piano. Umesh. Um, thank you for dropping me off. It's my pleasure. Nice, Umesh. Samuel, thank you for your help. Don't mention it. Samuel, nice. Shams, I'm looking for an ATM. It's over there. Good, Shams. Cecilia, can you read my mind? Yes, I can. Oh, no, that's scary. Good, Cecilia. Helga, what color are those bags? They are white. Sleepwalker, whose bag is it? That man left it. Can you help me, please? Matsuha, have you ever been downtown? No, I haven't. Cecilia, have you ever seen a have you ever seen have you ever seen mountain food or we say Fuji Mountain? Okay, Cecilia, we don't need a. Have you ever seen Fuji Mountain? Samuel, whose car is this? 
It's for Lolly. Helga, whose dog is this? It's my neighbor's doggy. Tetsu, have you ever seen whales? No, I haven't. Never. They are my friends. Maitra, have you ever cooked without burning it? <laughs> Roberto, let's play soccer. Sounds fun. Okay. Uh, Maynaz, can you cook pasta? Yes, I can. Mary, I have a headache. What should I do? You should lie down. Matza, how old are your children? They are 12 and 14. Umesh, have you ever been to India? No, I haven't. Neva, whose mother are you? <laughs> I am Kevin's mother. Yes, it is right, Neva. John, have you ever seen a volcano? Have you ever seen a volcano, John? No, I haven't because I do not live in a forest. Maita, uh, what should we do after this class? We should practice. We should practice what we learned. We should practice what we learned. Cecilia, how old are your children? They are 16 and 19. Lolly, can you speak English? No, I can't yet, but I hope to be able soon. Yes, you can, Lolly. I'm sure your English is great. Maitra, have you ever cooked without burning it? Very good. Tetsuo, how old are your how how old are your teachers? They are 35 and 42. Mary, thank you for your good advice. You are welcome. They are from India. Oh, <laughs> ah, Lolly. Roberto, can you drive a car? Yes, I can. Matsa, whose dog is it? I don't know. Tetsuo, whose car is it? I'm not sure. John, whose party is it? It's Jasmine's party. Menez, whose car is it? It's my car. <laughs> Good job. Good sentences, everyone. Good job. I'm having fun reading your sentences. Whose fish is it? I don't remember. <laughs> Umesh. Whose bike is it? It's Umesh's bike. Okay, I'm gonna grab a couple of pencils and we're gonna have a we're gonna have a chopstick lesson. Real quick, we'll do a, a, a one minute chopstick lesson. I got two pencils right here. You could hear them maybe. Okay, let's, we're, and again, we're, we always review. This is the first time with this worksheet, so we will review it again. So don't worry, we're gonna do it like tomorrow again. We'll review it. We always do it again so we get better. Okay, let's do a chopstick uh, lesson, everyone. So do you have two pencils or two pens? Okay, let's, let's have a chopstick. We're going to have a one-minute chopstick lesson. Okay, I got two pencils. How about you? I have two pencils. How about you? I have two pencils. How about you? Okay, so we're going to put the first pencil. So I'm right-handed, so I use my right hand to write I am right-handed. Some people are left-handed, but I am right-handed. <laughs> okay, Lolly has two pencils. Sleepwalker, okay, here we go. Okay, so I'm right-handed. This is my thumb. This is my forefinger. Forefinger and thumb. I'm going to place chopstick right like this. Okay. And it's kind of like holding it like here. And this isn't going to move. I'm not going to move this. This, the, the, the lower chopstick does not move. The lower chopstick does not move. Then I'm going to put the other on top. And then I'm going with my forefinger. So the action is happening with my forefinger. I'm going like this. So this doesn't move. Only the top one, only this one moves. And I'm using my forefinger. So my thumb is holding the two 
See? So my thumb is holding both chopsticks. This one does not move. This one on top moves. And I just go like that. And so I could, I could pick anything up, right? So very easy. I can, something big, I can cut. So, whoops, this is, this is kind of hard, the, the marker. I can do it. There we go, see, I'm right there. Okay. Ah, that's kind of fat and hard, but, um, okay, paper's easy, yeah. So, right there. All right, so. Do, do, do. So, that's our chopstick lesson, one minute. Do, do, do. And so, you just do that, and you could just eat with chopsticks, very easy to eat. And I, eating salad with a chopstick, with chopsticks is, is, is I think using uh, chopsticks to eat salad is better than a fork. Because you could just like, in, I don't know. I, I like using chopsticks to eat salad. Um, so in Japan, we use chopsticks. So we, I use them every day. Um, yeah, breakfast, lunch, and dinner. I'm always using chopsticks. Okay, that's our chopstick lesson. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, so we can use, uh, we could use pencils to eat. <laughs> so if you ever like, you go, oh, I don't have a fork. I don't have a, a, a spoon. I don't have chopsticks. Oh, I have pencils. I can eat with pencils. <laughs> okay, good job. All right, that was our chopstick lesson. Okay, let's go to our next activity. Here we go. Activity number four. It is dictation cards. Activity number four, dictation cards. And we're gonna practice, I don't think. I don't think. Negative, your idea, I don't think. So I don't think, so you say, oh, I don't think it's a good idea. I don't think you should do it. So like your opinion that, right? Think your idea, your opinion, and it's negative. Like, I don't think it's a good idea. I don't think you should use a fork. <laughs> I don't think you should use a knife. Okay, Mary, it's fun. You should um, try, try using chopsticks more. Oh, John eats sushi with a pencil. <laughs> Very good, John. Okay, yes, yes, Mitra. <coughs> Dictation cards. <clears throat> okay, <laughs> thank you. Tetsuo's Japanese, so Tetsuo doesn't need chopstick lesson. <laughs> okay, dictation cards. I don't think that's our pattern. We're going to do four steps. Step one, dictation. <clears throat> and I'm going to go fast and slow. So the first time we're going to go fast, and the second time we'll go slow. Okay, so challenge. The first time it's going to be fast. It'll be a challenge. But then the second time I'll go slow, so then you will understand the sentences. Step two, shadow. <clears throat> Shadowing is speaking practice. So step one, dictation is writing practice and shadowing is speaking practice. Three, take turns. I will say the sentence, then you will say the sentence. So we will practice to get, well, we will take turns. I will say it. When I'm saying the sentence, you are listening. And then when you are saying the sentence, I am listening. Okay, so we're going to take turns. And then step four is a quiz. Okay, so there we go. Dictation time. Our first step is dictation. So you need a pencil and you need paper. Pencil and paper because you're going to listen and write the sentences, okay? Listening and writing. I have right here, I got the cards right here. And we got, we have 
One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We have eight cards. Ah, oh. <laughs> Salah, M. Salah. What can I do to speak English fluently? Well, this is one way. We're doing four steps here. You're going to be listening and writing. That's going to, like, we have, like, step one is always listening, right? So when you're, when you're um, having a conversation, you're listening to someone, then you speak, right? So dictation is listening, and then shadowing is speaking. So this is good practice for you, Salah. Okay, so you need a pencil and paper, and this is for listening. Our topic is, I don't think. So all the sentences are going to include, I don't think. Okay, here we go. I'm going to go fast, so, so don't worry if it's too fast. Go, oh no, I can't write it down. That's okay, because the second time I will go slow. Okay, good John. John's got paper. Here we go. Roberto, Mwah. take it easy. See you tomorrow. I'm here tomorrow, Roberto, tomorrow. Okay, all right, good. Okay. We're going to count down. I'm going to go, I'm going to say each card three times fast. We got eight cards. I'm going to go fast, 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 fast. But then I'll go slow, 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 slow. So don't worry. Okay, let's count down. Here we go. Count down. Five, four, three, two, one. Here we go. I don't think he can come to the phone. I don't think he can come to the phone. I don't think he can come to the phone. Oh, okay, Niva. Um, I don't think that means your your opinion. It's a negative opinion, right? So I don't think you should go with that man or something, right? So it's your opinion, and it's a negative opinion. I don't think you should eat that food or. It, it smells funny. I don't think you should eat it, right? I don't think you should go outside at night or something, right? So it's your it's your opinion and it's negative. It's you think it's a, you don't think it's a good idea. Negative. Okay, here we go. Card number two. I don't think we should try to fix it ourselves. I don't think we should try to fix it ourselves. I don't think we should try to fix it ourselves. I don't think we should try to fix it ourselves. Okay, card number three. I don't think you need to print it. I don't think you need to print it. I don't think you need to print it. Okay, card number four. I don't think you will find it there. I don't think you will find it there. I don't think you will find it there. Card number five. I don't think Kim ought to smoke here. I don't think Kim ought to smoke here. I don't think Kim ought to smoke here. Okay, number six. I don't think John should translate it for you. I don't think John should translate it for you. I don't think John should translate it for you. Okay, number seven. I don't think you ought to open it. 
I don't think you ought to open it. I don't think you ought to open it. Okay, last card, number eight. I don't think she will graduate. I don't think she will graduate. I don't think she will graduate. <laughs> okay, that was fast, everyone. So don't, if it was too fast for you, don't worry. I'm going to do it again and we're going to go slow. So now you can check your sentence. <clears throat> you can check each word. See if you're missing any words, if you have all the words in order. So I'm going to go slow now. So if the first time was too fast, don't worry, because now we're going to go slow. Okay, here we go. Slow time. <laughs> Five, four, three, two, one. Card number one. I don't think he can come to the phone. I don't think he can come to the phone. I don't think he can come to the phone. Card number two. I don't think we should try to fix it ourselves. I don't think we should try to fix it ourselves. I don't think we should try to fix it ourselves. Card number three. I don't think you need to print it. I don't think... <coughs> sorry. <coughs> I'm sorry, I got hay fever. <coughs> I'm sorry, sorry. Okay, here we go. <coughs> I don't think you need to print it. I don't think you need to print it. I don't think you need to print it. Card number four. I don't think you will find it there. I don't think you will find it there. I don't think you will find it there. Number five. I don't think Kim ought to smoke here. I don't think Kim ought to smoke here. I don't think Kim ought to smoke here. Okay, number six. <clears throat> I don't think John should translate it for you. I don't think John should translate it for you. Number three. I don't think John should translate it for you. Number seven. I don't think you ought to open it. I don't think you ought to open it. I don't think you ought to open it. Here we go. Last card, number eight. I don't think she will graduate. I don't think she will graduate. I don't think she will graduate. Okay, that was dictation. We went fast and slow. Okay, now it's time to shadow. This is speaking practice, right? The first time, well, step one was dictation, and that was writing practice. You were listening and writing. You were listening and writing at the same time. Shadowing, you're listening and speaking at the same time. Input, output, input, output. It's a challenge, but that's why you are here. You still haven't seen, you haven't seen the picture. You haven't seen the sentence, no. However, 
We're going to shadow it. Then I will show you the sentence. You will see the card. You will see the picture. You will see the sentence, and you will understand the meaning of the sentence. Okay, here we go. Oh, Tetsu ought to, yeah, like so. Ought to means to like advice, right? You should. So should and ought to same same basically. Okay, here we go. Count down to shadowing time. Five, four, three, two, one. I don't think he can come to the phone. I don't think he can come to the phone. I don't think he can come to the phone. Okay, here is the card. Here is the sentence. I don't think he can come to the phone. Right. So. Your opinion negative, right? So,、um, let's say, for example, someone's calling for you, but you are in a different room, and then I'm talking to the person, and I say, for example, Lolly, right? So someone calls me. Oh, can I talk to Lolly? Oh, I don't think she can come to the phone. She's busy. She's feeding Diamond. She's giving Diamond a bath, and so she can't. Come to the phone. I don't think he can come to the phone, so he can't come to talk. Okay, here we go. Card number two. I don't think we should try to fix it ourselves. I don't think we should try to fix it ourselves. I don't think we should try to fix it ourselves. Okay, here's the card. I don't think we should try to fix it ourselves. Okay, so your computer is broken. It's a bad idea that you fix it, or we should fix it ourselves. No, that's a bad idea. Let's call support. Let's call a professional for help. So I don't think we should try to fix it ourselves. Bad idea. We will make it worse. We will make it even. We will break it even more. <laughs> oh, Lolly! <laughs> Thank you. Here we go. Card number three. I don't think you need to print it. 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 Okay, so like maybe you ask me, oh, should I print the paper? No, I don't think you need to print it. Do I need to print? Nah, you don't need to print it. I don't think you need to print it. I don't think you need to print it. Okay, here we go. Card number four. I don't think you will find it. There, I don't think you will find it there. I don't think you will find it there. I don't think you will find it there. So maybe looking for information. So the information you won't won't be there. The information you won't. I don't think you will find it there. The information you want. I don't think you will find it there. The information you want. I don't think you will find it there. Number five. I don't think Kim ought to smoke here. 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 So this is a no smoking area. So. I don't think you ought to smoke here. It's a non-smoking area. I don't think you ought to smoke here. This is a no-smoking area. Number six. I don't think John should translate it for you. I I don't think John should translate it for you. I don't think John should translate it for you. I don't think John should translate it for you. 
You should do it yourself. You need to learn it for yourself. You need to do it yourself. If you do it yourself, you will learn faster. So I don't think John should translate it for you. You should use a dictionary and you should do it yourself. You will learn faster that way. <laughs> Number seven. I don't think you ought to open it. 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 No, it's not your bag. I don't think you ought to open it. It's a bad idea. You might get in trouble. You don't know what's inside the bag. Don't open it. I don't think you ought to open it. Number eight, last card. I don't think she will graduate. 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 She's missed too many days at school. She hasn't been in class for a long time. She hasn't been to school in a long time. I don't think she will graduate. <laughs> All right, that was shadowing. Yes, it was. Okay, here we go. Take turns. I got paper right here. I got a card and I got the cards. I will say the sentence, then you will say a sentence. When it's your turn, I'm going to cover the sentence. So you have to say the sentence by only looking at the picture. It's a challenge, but that's why you're here. Let's go. Let's take turns. I will say the card and then you will say the card. Okay, here we go. Countdown. Five, four, three, two, one. Here we go. I don't think he can come to the phone. Now it's your turn. I don't think he can come to the phone. I don't think he can come to the phone. I don't think we should try to fix it ourselves. I don't think we should try to fix it ourselves. I don't think we should try to fix it ourselves. I don't think you need to print it. I don't think you need to print it. I don't think you need to print it. I don't think you will find it there. I don't think you will find it there. I don't think you will find it there. I don't think Kim ought to smoke here. I don't think Kim ought to smoke here. I don't think Kim ought to smoke here. I don't think John should translate it for you. <clears throat> I don't think John should translate it for you. I don't think John should translate it for you. <clears throat> okay, here we go. I don't think you ought to open it. I don't think you ought to open it.
I don't think you ought to open it. Okay, here we go. Last card. <clears throat> I don't think she will graduate. I don't think she will graduate. I don't think she will graduate. Okay. Okay, we took turns. Now it's time for the quiz. All right, so we're going to do the quiz now. I'm going to shuffle the cards so we don't know the order. We're going to use three cards. I'm going to cover the sentence, and you're going to write the sentence in the chat. So we don't know card one. We don't know card two. We don't know card three. It's a mystery. <laughs> It's a challenge. It's a quiz. What will card number one be? What will card number two be? <laughs> what will card number three be? Okay, here we go. Let's do the quiz. <clears throat> okay, got it, Lolly. Here we go. Write the sentence in the chat. Do you remember the sentence? Write the sentence in the chat. Here we go. Card number one. Quiz number one. Write the sentence in the chat. Write the sentence in the chat. Do you remember? Okay, Sleepwalker. Cecilia, Hel no, that's Helga, look at the picture, Helga. Okay, Mary, Bella, Bella, Bella. So, you know, in, in Japanese, Bella, or no, Bella, what, Tetra. K Bella. What's in Japanese, there's a word, Bella. Maybe I'm wrong. I was thinking, cheek in Japanese is, um, is that Bella? No. Never mind. Oh, tongue, Bella. That's it, Bella. Okay, tongue. I knew it was like body part or face, somewhere on her face. Bella, that's right. <laughs> Bella. No, Bello. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank you, Tetsuro. Tongue in Japanese, Bello. Be bello. <laughs> okay, let's have a look. There we go. Card number one. I don't think you need to print it. Very good. <laughs> All right, Bella. Bello, Bella, Bello. Bella. <laughs> okay, here we go. Card number two. Here we go. Write the sentence in the chat. Write the sentence in the chat. Do you remember the sentence? Okay, Shams, Samuel, Sleepwalker, Cecilia, Helga, Tetsuro. Maitra, Bella. So John, Konnichiwa. So in Japanese, hello is konnichiwa. Konnichiwa. Okay, lolly. Okay, let's find out. Here is the card, here is the sentence. Coming down, coming down. I don't think you will find it there. I don't think you will find it there. All right. Here we go. Card number three. 
Do you remember the sentence? Here we go. Last card for the quiz. Card number three. Write the sentence in the chat. And here it is. Do you remember the sentence? Write the sentence in the chat. Okay, Sleepwalker. Helga. Tetsuro. Mary. Trolley. Hello, Trolley. Cecilia. Bella. Lolly. Okay, good, good, good. Okay, let's have a look. It's coming down. Here we go. Good, John. Here we go. There it is. I don't think Kim ought to smoke here. Yeah. Okay, great, great, great. Yes. One, two, three. That was the fourth step. That was the quiz. You did it. Great job, everyone. Mwah. Congratulations. Yeah. Okay, that was dictation cards. The topic was, I don't think your opinion, it's a, it, it's a negative. I don't think you should do it. Okay, good, good, good. All right, we got one more to do, everybody, and this is Lolly's Revenge. And we're going to do poll. Yep, I'm, I'm not going to forget the poll. Thank you. So I'm going to put, I'm going to put a star here, an asterisk, put poll, so we don't forget. Okay, let's go number five. Let's put number five right here next to the, that way it will be easy. For sure, I'm not going to forget. Number five, Lolly's Revenge. Okay, so like the dictation, we got one, two, three, four steps. Lolly's Revenge, four steps. Step number one is the conversation. Okay, I'm going to read the conversation. And then step two is questions and answers. So I'm going to ask you questions, and you're going to answer the questions. Then step three, we're going to read the we're going to read the conversation together. And then step four, we're going to shadow the conversation. Okay, so we got four steps for your success. We got Lolly's Revenge. It's a conversation between two people, Joe and Sue. Joe and Sue. And I have the conversation right here. It's also on my Patreon page. I There's a worksheet with the... Well, it's not a worksheet. It's the conversation with the answers, just like this. Okay, we got the conversation. I got some questions for you, right? So I'm going to read the conversation, and then I want you to listen carefully because you will answer those questions. I will ask you questions, and then you answer the questions. Now, um, I will read the conversation three times, so listen carefully. This is Joe. When you see my thumb, Joe is speaking. When you see my pinky, Sue is speaking. Okay, so here we go. Joe and Sue, Lolly's Revenge, conversation. Countdown, five, four, three, two, one. Here we go. Joe is first. It's a beautiful day, isn't it? It's a little hot today. Aren't you feeling well? Since you asked, I'm a little blue. What's wrong? Nothing. I just want to stay home today. Is there anything I can get you? I have a bit of a sweet tooth. What sweets do you want? Why don't you surprise me? Okay, that was one time. Here we go. Second time. 
Joe is first. Here we go. It's a beautiful day, isn't it? It's a little hot today. Aren't you feeling well? Since you asked, I'm a little blue. What's wrong? Nothing. I just want to stay home today. Is there anything I can get you? I have a bit of a sweet tooth. What sweets do you want? Why don't you surprise me? Okay, Lolly. Good, John. Okay, here's the third time. I'm gonna go slow, okay? Okay, Lolly, we're gonna go slow. The third time, I will go slow and then I will ask you questions. Okay, so here I go. It's a beautiful day, isn't it? It's a little hot today. Aren't you feeling well? Since you asked, I'm a little blue. What's wrong? Nothing. I just want to stay home today. <laughs> One more time. Sorry. Nothing. I just want to stay home today. Is there anything I can get you? I have a bit of a sweet tooth. What sweets do you want? Why don't you surprise me? Okay, that was the conversation. Okay, there it is. So I'm going to have my pen. There's the box and I'm going to check it because it is finished. Now, step two, questions and answers. Are you ready to answer the questions? Here we go. Answer the question, please. Question number one. What does Sue want to do today? Question number one. What does Sue want to do today? What does Sue want to do today? And I'm going to get some more coffee. You. You answer the question and I'm going to get coffee. It's right there. What does Sue want to do today? Answer the question while I pour some more coffee. <laughs> oh, it's hot. It's delicious. Okay. Question number one. Oh, I like it. It's hot. It's getting cold in here. It's getting cold. Okay, question number one. What does Sue want to do today? Okay, here we go. Sleepwalker says she wants to stay home. Lolly, she wants to stay home. Mary, Sue wants to stay home. Helga, she wants to stay home. Tetsuro, she wants to stay home today. John will get water. You got it, buddy. Yeah, Tesla wants. Yeah, she wants. He wants. It wants. Okay, Samuel. Good. Cecilia. Trolley. Bella. You got it. Matsura. You are correct. So, question number one. What does Sue want to do today? She wants to stay home. Okay, here we go. Question number two. How is Sue feeling today? How is Sue feeling today? How is Sue feeling today? How is Sue feeling today?
Okay, hold on, Bella. I'll, I'll explain. I will just wait, please. I will talk about it. Okay. How is Sue feeling today? No, hello. Mwah. Okay. Let's see. Sleepwalker. She is a little blue today. Lolly. She is feeling blue. Oh, okay. Yeah, Bella. She feels a little blue. Tetsuro, she is feeling a little blue today. Helga, she is a little blue. Mary, she is feeling a little blue. Maitra, she is a little blue. <laughs> Matsa, Sue is a little or feeling blue. Okay, you can say this. Sue is feeling a little blue. She is feeling a little blue. Samuel, Sue is feeling a little blue. So that means she's a little sad. When you're feeling a little blue, you're a little sad. When you're a little blue, you are a little sad. So Sue is a little sad. She is feeling blue. Sue is a little sad. She is feeling blue. Oh, thank you, John. Yeah, so today I was working at my university, so I was... After a word tie. Today was the first day. So this was the first week back at school. Yesterday I had class. Today I had class. And so, so this is what I wore today in class. Okay, here we go. Question number three. Question number three. What does Sue have today? What does Sue have today? Aha, sleep Parker. Too cool for school. So first day, so my students, so I have to like, I have to show a good impression, right? First day of class, I always wear a tie. But probably next week, I will stop wearing a tie. First week, I wear a tie. Okay, here we go. Question number three. What does Sue have today? What does Sue have today? Okay, Helga. All right, Lolly. All right, Tetsuro. Yes, Mary. Yes, Bella. Okay, good. So, so Bella, you had a question, what is a bit of a sweet tooth? What does that mean? Was that your question? I have to go back. Okay, so Bella, a bit of a, a bit is a little. So a tw sweet tooth means you have, oh, I want something sweet. I, I feel like something sweet. I, I'm hungry for something sweet. So a bit, a little, a bit of a sweet tooth. I have a bit of a sweet tooth today. So I feel like something sweet. I feel like something sweet. I want something sweet to eat. I want something sweet to eat. So that's right. So question number three, what does Sue have today? Sue has a sweet tooth today. Sweet. <laughs> Sue has a sweet tooth today. Can you say that fast? Sue has a sweet tooth today. Sue has a sweet tooth today. Sue has a sweet tooth today. Here we go. Sue has a sweet tooth today. 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 <laughs> Nelson, hello Nelson. Mwah. Good morning, Nelson. There you go, Lo Lolly. Sweet tooth equal fancy some sweets. Yeah, good Lolly. Thank you. Okay, here we go. Question number four. One more question. Question number four. What sweets do you think Joe will get her? 
Okay, so question four is not in the conversation. You have to use your imagine, imagination. You have to use your imagination. It is not in the conversation. You have to use your imagination. All right. So question number four: What sweets do you think Joe will get Sue? What sweets or sweet will Joe get Sue? Your imagination. What do you think Joe will get Sue? Good food. Hello. Okay, Sleepwalker. Joe will buy a cake and some candies. Mitra. So, not what she wants. What is Joe going to get her? So, so Sue says. So Joe asks, "What sweets do you want?" So Joe asks, "Sue, what sweets do you want?" And Sue says, "Why don't you surprise me? Why don't you surprise me?" So Sue doesn't say. So you have to use your imagination. Imagination. You have to be Joe. You are Joe. What are you going to get, Sue? So you are Joe. What are you going to get, Sue? What are you going to get for her sweet tooth? What are you going to get for her sweet tooth? Lolly, Joe has a large choice.、Uh, like Sue likes cotton candy, salted caramel, candied fruit, and so on. Wow, cotton candy, salted caramel. Hmm, that sounds good. Fruited candy. Hmm, nice choices. Lolly, good choices. Mary says Joe will get chocolate and vanilla ice cream. Here we go. Tetsuro says he will get the biggest cake in his neighborhood. Yeah. Go into the bakery. Give me the biggest cake you have. <laughs> Joe walks into the bakery. He says to the baker, "Get me, or I should say, give me, give me the biggest cake you have." Here is Joe walking into the bakery. Hello, Mr. Baker. Please, may I have the biggest cake you have? <laughs> may I have the biggest cake you have here in the shop? Can I get the biggest cake you have here in the shop? It's for my girl Sue. She has a sweet tooth today. Samuel. So, what is Joe going to get her? Remember, you are Joe. What are you going to get? You. We don't know what Sue wants. She didn't say what she wants. Just get me something sweet. So Sue says, "Get me something sweet." So what are you going to get? Good Helga, but what is it? Come on, Helga. What do you think he will bring to Sue? Okay, Maita. Joe will bring her dark chocolate. Trolley. Joe will buy some candies and chocolate. Okay, Matsa. Now, what she wants? What is Joe going to get? No, Tetsuro. Sweet tooth is you feel like something sweet. So you have a you have a feeling. You have a desire. You have a craving for something sweet. So when you have a sweet tooth, you want. To eat something sweet, right? So maybe、um, you and your friends, you're talking, and you go, "Hey, what do you want to do, or what should we do today?" And you say, "Oh, you know what? I have a sweet tooth. Let's go get something sweet. Let's go to the ice cream shop. Let's go to the to the 
to the candy store. <laughs> I have a sweet tooth. I want to eat something sweet. So a sweet tooth means you have, you want to eat something sweet. You have a craving for something sweet. You want to eat something sweet. Oh, macaron. Okay, Cecilia wants, says Joe will get her a macaron. Oh, Samuel, a French pastry. Bella says she wants chocolate, lots of chocolate candies and chocolate cake. <laughs> Don't fall down with the biggest cake. That's right, Sleepwalker. Um, Sleepwalker, please help Joe. Maybe he needs help. So please help him with the biggest cake in the neighborhood. Oh, nice, John. You're lucky. John says, I will get a very big chocolate cake for my birthday. My birthday's coming soon. My birthday is next month. I'm having a birthday next month. Oh, mozzarella. Mwah, thank you. Oh, Samuel, Joe will buy her some donuts. Yeah, donuts are very sweet. Yeah, I like donuts. <laughs> donuts are delicious. <laughs> Good food says, um, we'll go to the ice cream shop and eat vanilla ice cream. Sounds delicious. You're welcome, Matsura. Mwah. Oh, John, my birthday is May. Ah, oh, Sleepwalker, you remembered. Sleepwalker, mwah, mwah. I love you, Sleepwalker. You remembered my birthday. <laughs> that is very thoughtful of you. That's very kind of you to remember. Helga, I think Joe has to bring two bags, one with the chocolates and cakes and the other bag with beer and chips. Nice. Okay, good, good, good. Well, okay, let's, that was the questions. Good job, everyone. Q&A, you did a good job, of course. So, it's done. Okay, now step three, let's read the conversation. Okay, let's read it. I will put it on the board. Yeah, Lolly, so we're having birthdays. John's having a birthday in June, so we're coming up to birthdays. Okay, let's have a look at the conversation. Let's read the conversation together. Here we go. Let's make it big. Let's make it full screen. Okay, there it is, full screen. Here we go, Joe is first. It's a beautiful day, isn't it? It's a little hot today. Aren't you feeling well? Since you asked, I'm a little blue. What's wrong? Nothing, I just want to stay home today. Is there anything I can get you? I have a bit of a sweet tooth. What sweets do you want? Why don't you surprise me? <laughs> okay, let's do it again. Okay, good, 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 Menes. Did I misspell? Oh, no! Oh, no! Ah! Typo! I hate doing that. E E. It's E E. E A sweat like you're 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 perspiring. No, it is E E. Thank you. Gosh, I always make mistakes. Too many. Sweet. There you go. E E. Sorry, sorry. I can't believe it. Sorry, sorry. Not sweat. Not sweat, sweet. 
This is sweet. Okay, it's a it's a sweet sweat. That's perspire. That is Mark is perspiring. Mark is sweating. He made a he made a mistake. Oh no. That is sweat. This is sweet. Ah. Thank you, Lolly. Okay, here we go, back. Ah. I hate making mistakes like this. Okay, here we go, let's read again. And, and it, it's sweet, everybody. E-E, -E. sorry. Okay, here we go, Joe says, it's a beautiful day, isn't it? It's a little hot today. Aren't you feeling well? Since you asked, I'm a little blue. What's wrong? Nothing. I just want to stay home today. Is there anything I can get you? I have a bit of a sweet tooth. <laughs> oh, I'm so embarrassed. It's embarrassing. Um, what sweets do you want? Why don't you surprise me? Oh, it's embarrassing. Haskashi. That is embarrassed in Japanese. Haskashi. Okay. Yeah, no, Lolly. Don't have a sweat tooth. <laughs> oh, I can't believe it. Oh. I'm sad. I'm feeling blue. Haskash. I'm feeling blue. I'm feeling sad. Okay. Let let's shadow now. I feel I feel blue. Okay, here we go. It's sweet. Okay. Thank you. Thank you so much. Okay. There we go. Let's, we read it. <laughs> now it's time to shadow. Thank you, Lolly. Here we go. Ah, I just like, I'm so stupid to, ah. It's careless, right? So I'm not, so it's a careless mistake. So I'm not paying attention. I'm just, you know, so that that's what that's what um that that's what is um aggravating about it is it's just a, a silly mistake and I should I should know better I shouldn't do that so it, it's it's disappointing I disappointed in myself okay ah oh, Tetsuro. <laughs> Ah, oh, I'm, uh, yeah, that's, that's good, Tesso. Sweat tooth equals uh, salty sweets. Yeah, that's good. <laughs> okay, it is time to shadow right here. It is speaking practice. So let's say the sentence together. Manome, I am far from perfect. I, here, here's perfect right here. I am way over here. <laughs> I'm far from perfect. Here's like perfect, like perfect people here. I am way over there. <laughs> I am far from perfect. Here I am. Here's perfect. Here I am. I'm far away. Bella, thank you so much. You're too kind. Kind. You are very, very kind. Okay, here we go. Let's do it. It is time to shadow. Let's say the conversation together. Here we go. Countdown to shadowing. Five, four, three, two, one. Here we go. It's a beautiful day, isn't it? It's a beautiful day, isn't it? It's a beautiful day, isn't it? It's a little hot today, 
It's a little hot today. It's a little hot today. Aren't you feeling well? Aren't you feeling well? Aren't you feeling well? Since you asked, I'm a little blue. Since you asked, I'm a little blue. Since you asked, I'm a little blue. What's wrong? What's wrong? What's wrong? Nothing. I just want to stay home today. Nothing. I just want to stay home today. Nothing. I just want to stay home today. Is there anything I can get you? Is there anything I can get you? Is there anything I can get you? I have a bit of a sweet tooth. I have a bit of a sweet tooth. I have a bit of a sweet tooth. What sweets do you want? What sweets do you want? What sweets do you want? Why don't you surprise me? Why don't you surprise me? Why don't you surprise me? Okay, that was the conversation. Good job. Yes, yes, yes. I read you the conversation. I asked you questions and you answered the questions. We read the conversation and we shadowed the conversation. Four steps, Lolly's Revenge, yay. Four steps for your success, yay. Okay, one more thing to do, everybody. It is time for the poll. Let's do the quiz. There is a quiz in the poll in the chat on top of the chat there is a blue box let's check it out oh, oh we have a question lolly says since you asked instead of since since you asked no 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 because it, it's already been dead it's already been done right lolly so here we'll, we'll i'll show you the conversation here so um it's already been asked, right? So, um, so Joe here asks Sue, aren't you feeling well? And then um, Sue says, since you asked, right? Because he already did it. So it has to be in the past tense. Okay. And any other questions with the conversation? So, um, it's a beautiful day, isn't it? That's a tag question, isn't it? And then we have, um, it's a little hot today. Aren't you feeling well? Since you asked, right? Because asked, it's the past tense because Joe already, he, he said, aren't you feeling well? So he asked her a question. A little blue. Okay, good. Lolly. I'm a little blue. That means you're a little sad. What's wrong? Like, what's your problem? And then nothing. I just want to stay home. Is there anything I can get you? I have a bit of a sweet tooth. That's a misspelling. What sweets do you want? It's E-E, -E, not E-A. Why don't you surprise me? So she wants Joe to make the choice. So she wants Joe. Joe to make the choice. Why don't you surprise me? You decide. Okay, that was the conversation. Lolly's revenge. Okay, let's check out the quiz in the poll. In the chat, on top of the chat, there is a blue box. Let's check it out. Here we go. 80 people voted. Thank you so much, everybody. And we have... You have, it's a quiz, dried grass, which is used to feed cows and horses is. So which, what is dried grass? Is it herb? Is it seaweed? Is it hay? Is it wheat? What do you feed 
cows and horses, herb, seaweed, hay, or wheat? Which one is it? Is it herb? Is it seaweed? Is it hay? Is it wheat? Which one do you give to horses and cows? Oh, Samar, I'm feeling well today. Very good. Ha <laughs> ha, John wants some sweet chocolate. John is now, John now has a sweet tooth. After, after the conversation, John has a sweet tooth. Okay. Mary says, I think it's hay. Lolly says, hay. Tetsuro says, hay. Trolley says, hay. Ella says, hey. John says, hey. <laughs> Bella says, herb or hay. Lolly says, I want to hit the hay. <laughs> that's, a, that's an expression. Hit the hay. That's right. Go to sleep. Uh, Naga says, hey. And the correct answer is hay. <laughs> H-A-Y. That is dried grass which you feed to horses and cows. Horses and cows eat hay. Oh, Helga, I like it. Seaweed is for seahorses and sea cows. <laughs> That's good. I like it, Helga. Good joke. Yeah, dry grass is hay. Very good. That's a good joke, Helga. I like it. I might, can I use that sometime? I'm going to use that joke. Do I have your permission to use that joke to my students? Marcos! <laughs> okay, everybody. We are over two hours. Over two hours again. So we did five activities and we did the poll. Thank you so much, everyone. Mwah. I will be back tomorrow. Yes, Wednesday. This time tomorrow, Wednesday, 5 p.m. So I'm here on Tuesdays, 5 p.m. Wednesdays, 5 p.m. Fridays, 10 a.m. Saturdays, 10 a.m. I live in Japan, so this is Japan time. Tuesday, 5 p.m. Japan time. Wednesdays, 5 p.m. Japan time. Fridays, 10 a.m. Japan time. Saturdays, 10 a.m. Japan time. Yes, over two hours today. So, I will be back tomorrow, tomorrow, tomorrow. And we're going to review some of the things we did today and we will do some new things too. So, tomorrow, review and new. And yes, join the friendly green team. Thank you for saying that, Lolly. Thank you everyone, help me, support me, join the green team. By joining the green team, your name will be in green, just like Lolly, just like Tetsuro you see right there. And um, also, my Patreon, please everyone. So, I have all the worksheets, all the cards we do in the live stream class are on my Patreon page. Go there, support me, Five dollars each month. Help me to help you. You get all the worksheets. I, I would uh, really, really appreciate it. There's a link in the descriptions. Go to my Patreon. Join Patreon. Get the worksheets. Get the cards. Also, I have books at Amazon.com. And um, I have a website there. Worksheets and flashcards that go with my videos. On Patreon, worksheets and cards we do here in our live stream classes. Uh, my website, markkulik.com, worksheets and flashcards that go with my videos. So check everything out in the descriptions. I really appreciate it. Mwah. Bella's coming back tomorrow. Thank you, Bella. Okay, good, thank you. I will be back tomorrow. Thank you, Ella. All right, let's say goodbye together, shall we? And I always say smile because when you smile, you make other people happy. And when you smile, you are happy. So 
Happiness is very, very important. So smiling is very, very important. So everyone, smile. Stay healthy. Yes, that's important. Healthy. Be safe. That's very important. So three important things. Smile. Be healthy. Stay safe. Smile. Be healthy. Stay safe. Okay? Do that for sure. <laughs> love and peace. Yes, love and peace. Mwah. Let's count down to saying goodbye until tomorrow, until Wednesday, 5 p.m. here tomorrow. Okay, let's count down. Are you ready? Here we go. Thank you so much, everyone. Mwah, love you. Here we go. Count down. Five, four, three, two, one. Thank you so much, everyone. Mwah. I'll be back tomorrow. Please come back and see me tomorrow. Take it easy. Bye. Thank you.